Hey guys, how you doing? Hope you're well. It's Alessio speaking to you today from Budapest in Hungary. Actually, I, as I mentioned in a previous video, this is actually my first time in Hungary and uh, really enjoying it, guys. Fantastic city. Uh, let's talk about Bitcoin now. In this video, what I want to talk about and what I want to try and address is the question which a lot of folks are asking, I'm sure you've been asking it, which is, is a bull market in Bitcoin confirmed? Now, that question may come as a surprise to some of you, given the incredible action on Bitcoin recently. And some of you are probably already thinking that a bull market, of course, has been confirmed, given the action that we've seen on Bitcoin. But I think, again, we need to look at the charts and see what the charts are telling us. All right, guys, let's start at the beginning. Uh, you may remember some weeks ago, I posted the video and I said that if three things happen on Bitcoin, I could potentially change my mind and indeed uh, say that the Bitcoin bull market has been confirmed. Now, two of those conditions, I think, have potentially been met. And those conditions were the first one. One of the most important conditions was if we see two consecutive closes on the monthly time frame, two closes above the 21 monthly average. And guess what? The month of May also has closed above the 21 monthly average. Uh, you may remember last month I said, look, if both months, the month of April and the month of May, close above their 21 monthly average, then a potential bull market could be confirmed. And that's precisely what's happened on the trading view charts anyway. On the MT4 charts, that has not been confirmed, but bottom line is on the trading view charts, which includes, includes weekend data, that has been confirmed. We've seen two consecutive closes on the monthly time frame above the 21 monthly average. For those of you who may not be aware or didn't see the previous video, uh, what I explained was in 2015, Bitcoin did that. And usually when any market, not just Bitcoin, when they close above the 21 monthly average at least twice, then a bull market, a potential or technical bull market has been confirmed. So that criteria for the moment appears to be confirmed on Bitcoin. Uh, the other criteria on Bitcoin was if we see a close above the 6,800 level of resistance, and that of course also has been confirmed. Uh, Bitcoin has rallied above 6,800, is not falling below it. Although the potential for falling below 6,800 is still there, but we'll cover that in a separate video. Now I know what you're probably thinking. Uh, okay, so we have a technical bull market confirmed. The charts are saying we're in a bull market, but you know, what do I think? Or what does anybody else think, right? The thing is, what I've learned in my experience is this. Uh, a good mentor of mine once said that you have to make decisions based on what you see, not based on what you think. So as chartists, as technical analysts, we do need to go with the charts. It doesn't really matter what we think. Don't get me wrong here, guys. I mean, I have my doubts that we're in a bull market. I, I am not convinced that we're in a bull market. Uh, there's a lot of reasons for this. One of them is the speed of this massive move. There are other reasons too, which we'll probably cover in another video. But the bottom line is this, guys. You have to make decisions based on what you see, not on what you think. Because it's possible that what you might think may conflict with what you see on the charts. And I usually found that going with the charts is a better idea. One reason, for example, why I have doubts that this is a bull market is, well, the fact that there's extreme sentiment, extreme bullish sentiment, uh, similar to the 2017 levels. I mean, this is uh, extremely a contrarian indicator. The second thing is the, the massive parabolic rise in Bitcoin. So there's a lot of things that make me concerned and make me worry that this is a bull market in Bitcoin. But you know what, guys, it is what it is. And as the famous phrase says, you know, you make decisions based on what you see, not on what you think. And as good chartists and as good technical analysts, we need to make decisions based Based on what we see on the charts right now on Bitcoin. So at the moment, the charts seem to indicate we could potentially be in a potential bull market uh, on Bitcoin. But we'll have to wait and see. By the way, guys, check out this uh, interesting Hungarian money I've got here, uh, which is 10,000 10, Hungarian forint, which is equivalent to about, uh, about 30 pounds. So I'm going to see if this 10,000 uh, HUF is going to get me anything uh, interesting to eat, maybe uh, some burgers, maybe some Hungarian food like goulash or something. All right, guys, I uh, hope this video helps. If it has, please give it a thumbs up and also please subscribe for future updates. I'll look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Thanks a lot.